Hi, welcome to Phone Inc. Mobile Repair Tutorial number 3. Today, we are going to show you how to repair the Sony Ericsson K800i. Um, most problem is the LCD, so we're going to go through how to change your LCD on the Sony Ericsson today. Okay, let's start with, first of all, you need the LCDs. There we go. And you need a tweezers, a T5 screwdriver, a flat hair screwdriver and a small flip head. Okay, now before you open the phones, a couple of things that you need to remember. First of all, these camera cases has to be closed, the camera lenses, otherwise you will damage when you open it you'll damage the uh, opening mechanisms. Now second thing is remember to take out your memory card very important because sometimes uh, they get jammed in the process of opening up the housings and then next thing is make sure your phone is totally switched off and then you take out your batteries and your SIM cards as well so back cover, take out your batteries now take out the SIM cards, I don't have a SIM card in here it's good to start with, we need a small Phillips head. There's two screws for the back housings. So unscrew those two screws. And make sure the camera lens is closed. Now, there's two clips on each side of the back housings. You can use your nail or you can use one of those plastic separators or you can use a guitar pick. Once you unclick those four clips, you push it upwards towards the top and the back housing should come off pretty easily. After you took it off, make sure you Got the uh, power switch there. Don't make sure that you don't lose it. Okay. Now, as you can see, there's four screws on each end of the phone. You use the T5. Unscrew those. They are slightly bigger screws, so you won't miss it. Just nice and slowly. Okay, after you've done that, let's take out the front housings. There's four clips on, on, on each side of the phones. While you are, we can just, it's all plastic so it should be very easy to unclip them. You can bend the plastic a little bit more. Shouldn't be an issue as long as you don't break them. Uh, just remember, when you open up the phones don't take it straight out because there is the uh, memory card slot door opener is uh, attached to the uh, main board. Now take care from the left hand side slowly and make sure as you can see there's a latch that's leaching on the main unit. What we need to do is use the small tweezers just to pull it out gently there is a clip on the main unit which you will need to slightly bend it a little bit just so that the the opener can come out there we go okay you can see that it's only a back hood so once that's out there's no issues now turn the main units around. You got your keypads and your LCDs. To take the, to change your LCD, you need to take to take the keypads out first. The keypads is two parts: it's the top joystick and the number plate. You can take the number plate out pretty easily. Take 
the top hat as well. Just when you take them out, remember there's a camera switch to slide it out the socket. Then there's two clip on each side of the keypad. And they come out. Okay, now just be careful because it's still attached onto the main board. Don't move it or don't force it. Now once that's up, you can take out the LCDs, the housing of the LCDs along with the LCDs. Again, two clip on each side. Move the metal plates, two clips, and also the housing of the LCDs. Okay, so that comes out. Just gently put it down. It's, it is attached to the main board in this position. Take the mouse slowly, unclip it, 